The last time I was um, playing on this island on stream, I was doing some Happy Home Paradise to try and unlock the um, changing the house thing. Um, and I knew that it was 30 homes and I had done my 30th home at the end of stream. Um, but then I, um, then the next day Tom Nook didn't tell me about the house renovation feature. So I looked it up and you have to actually do the 30th home and then do the final amenity. So it's, it, you essentially have to complete the DLC, but that happens after 30 homes. Um, so I thought I had finished it last stream, but I didn't, but I have now finished it. So off stream, I built the last Happy Home Paradise amenity. I, I did the whole cutscene with the festival. And, uh, then the next in-game day, Tom Nook said that, um, the villagers have heard of my decorating prowess and would like me to, um, re Tom Nook is offering the service now where we can redo the homes, which was something I was trying to, um, trying to work towards so that I um, could uh, redecorate all the villager homes a little bit. Um, I just want to, I'm not gonna do like full on, um, I'm not gonna do like full on in-depth builds for all of them like I've been doing for the ones like on my YouTube and stuff on my main island. Um, but I am just gonna sort of like tweak the colors a little bit and maybe put in like a couple of like some more spring accents and um, maybe if there's like a sort of crucial piece of furniture mi mi missing, um, I might like add something in as well. Um, so that's what we're gonna do today um, is just sort of go, th oh, I don't have any, thank you so much for the follow, welcome in. I beat my alerts, finish saying it before the alert even goes in. Um, thank you so much for the follow. I'm glad you're enjoying the, uh, the stream. We do have anonymous follows, um, so if you want to remain anonymous, uh, feel free to lurk away. Or if you want to make yourself known in chat, feel free as well. Whatever works. Um, I forget what I was saying now. Oh yeah, so I'm not gonna do, like, full in-depth builds. Um, I did also trade myself a bunch of items, um, from my other character. So, some of them are in my inventory. Most of them are scattered along the ground. Classic. <laughs> um, what I'm actually trying to get is my shovel, though. Um, so yeah, I was, uh, I did a bit, I did a lot of admin off stream, um, including trading items. I, um, did a little more work on some custom codes, but not a whole lot. Um, and I started trying to tidy up some flowers as well. But I don't think I got there in the end. I don't remember. <laughs> um, but that's fine. So, I also read... When I was looking up about how to unlock the home renovation feature, um, I th believe it also said that you can do more than one redecoration at once. So normally with, um, with building, like if you're building an incline or moving a building, um, resident services can only do one of those at once. Like you can only move one building and then you have to wait till the next day for it to be completed to then move another building. Likewise, if you like get a, a bridge or an incline going, you can only do one of those at once. But the internet tells me that apparently you can do multiple home renovations at once. If not, we'll just time, we'll just do one and then time travel forward a day. Like it's not the end of the world, but in theory, the internet tells you that tells me you can do multiple. So we'll see. Um, hi, Raina, how are you doing? Welcome in, happy Thursday. Um, I hope you're having a good day so far. Oh, ketchup's got a thought bubble. Ketchup, you know, you can't move out. You have to stay. <laughs> um, just a quick refresher also for anyone who, uh, hasn't been here for other Animal Crossing streams. Do multiples of? Multiples of... What? Oh, the thing I was just explaining about. Um... So my island is gonna be, well, I'm aiming for cherry blossom season, we'll see. Um, but it's gonna be just very like natural spring um, flowers and, and stuff. That's the that's the vibe I'm going for. Um, I, uh, I haven't finished decorating this bit also, but um, just to sort of give you an idea of like what I'm going for, um, it's like this kind of stuff. So the regular hardwood trees are gonna be pink cherry blossom trees. Um, yeah, and uh, and uh, yeah, this is this is what we're this is what we're going for. 
Um, but I haven't finished decorating the outside, but I, um, I'm i gonna do the insides today. I also worked a bit on my, my treehouse custom designs because I didn't like it with the trees. So I haven't finished that middle piece yet, but it is getting, it's getting better, I think. I also need to change the color of the blue, but it's getting better, I think. Um, so we'll see, we'll see. But anyway, I was just doing a little lap. Um, you put um, so much effort in. Uh, it looks really good. Thank you so much, Raina. I really appreciate that. Yeah, I've been putting, I, I really wanted to like, cause I, I, I've only ever done my like main island, which is the switch that I, the, it's the one that I started on like pretty much when the game first came out. Like that's been the same island. So I've never really like done start to finish like a whole island like decorating. So it's like those YouTube island shows. Well, thank you. Um, yeah, I'm pretty happy with how it's turning out so far. I have had to make all my own custom designs, which is pretty, uh, pretty tedious because I don't have online on this account, but that's okay. That's okay. Um, shall we just dive in with one? I think so. I don't really have a concrete idea of what we're doing for any of them. Um, for the redecorating, that is. Um, other than like just making it more spring. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. Thank you so much for the follow. Uh, I'm glad you're enjoying the stream. Um, if you want to uh, remain anonymous, then feel free to lurk away. Or if you want to introduce yourself in chat, feel free as well. Need to renew my Nintendo Switch online. I think mine's set to auto renew. Um, so thankfully I don't have to worry about that. Expired yesterday on my birthday. Oh my gosh, was yesterday your birthday? Oh my gosh, happy belated birthday. I didn't realize it was your birthday. Um, but um, ha ha happy birthday. Um, what did you What did you get up to? Um, any any exciting birthday things? Um, a residence home. Here we go. Um, I I'm just gonna start at the be at the like at the first in the list and just work my way through that way because like I said I don't have a concrete idea for any specific home. Um, so I'm just gonna <laughs> just, just gonna start at the beginning and go from there. Um, had my stream and then went out with friends for dinner. Oh, nice! I hope that those both went well. Um, heck yeah. Um, so the first three, these first three villagers actually don't have their default homes because when the, when the first three move onto your island, they move in with a, a sort of more simplified design. Um, so these, these might be the ones that we end up, like, having to do the most work on, potentially, although it, I'm not sure. We'll see, but, um, but yeah, we'll, we'll start with Sherb. Um, but yeah, I hope that both your birthday stream and your birthday dinner went well. Okay. Now, what I'm gonna do is move my water. Is it gonna be in the way there? I think it's okay. Uh, oh, I will hydrate. Thank you, Techno. Welcome in, Techno. How are you doing? Um, thank you for the hydrate. Um, officially 3.03 now. What? What? Do you mean, what? Or are you saying 33? I'm confused. <laughs> Time does fly, though. That's very true. That's very true. Um... Tell you what I'm gonna do is look up a picture of what Sherb's original house interior looks like because um, I wanna try and like, I wanna see if that's something we wanna pull in as well maybe. Cause like I said, he'll have his um, simplified one. Gonna lurk so I can put my keyboard away and finish setting the game up. Uh, enjoy, have a good lurk. Thank you so much. Um, thank you so much for popping into chat. Always lovely to see you um, and have a good lurk as well. Um, and um, yeah, uh, enjoy enjoy the setting up the game as well, and enjoy the game itself. Um, my channel, or is that I'm very old? Oh yes, I have I have heard a little bit of this lore. Um, okay, we're gonna start with the interior, but I am actually gonna change the exterior a little bit as well. Um, it's like it's like bright blue right now, which is fine. It's like cute, but I'm worried it's gonna like clash with the uh, with the. Um, 
with the cherry blossoms and stuff like the outside of the island. So I was 302 years old, but now I'm 303 naturally. Oh, yes. Okay. Yes. That, yep. That, that makes sense. That makes sense. Um, yes, I think I have heard the lore that you're, you're very old, but, uh, I didn't remember the exact, exact age. So, yeah, this is, um, hang on, I can, um, I can show, hang on a second. I will show you what, um, Sherb's original house looks like. Um, via the, uh, the Squirtle source. There we go. Um, so this is the exterior, and then this is what his, uh, original home looks like. Um, and obviously, uh, you can see that this one is a lot more, like, themed to him. It's got, like, the, the baby blue and stuff. Uh, this is a generic one, so. Um, also just had a thought for the urban legend story, but I realize if I do it that way, it'll probably mix fantasy and sci-fi. I'm not sure if they mix or not. I mean, I think they could if you wanted them to. I think that's up to you, though. Um, that depends. Um, it's, it's quiet in here. We also, let's play some music for Sherb, and that can be, like, the first thing that we, that we do. Um, let's get a music player. Um, now, a little problem with this is that I don't know what I have in my Happy on Paradise catalog, because it does depend a little bit on, like, what builds you've done, um, when you get, like, um, uh, you can include crafted items, but you need to, um, you need to have crafted some of them before sometimes and stuff like that. Let's look what Sherb's favorite song is so that we can play it for him. Um, songs. Is this... Okay, well, this is a different wiki than I'm used to using, so the information is not readily available to me. Favorite song. Hypno KK? Hypno KK. Hopefully I have that. Um, well, the alphabet... Aha, Hypno KK. Okay, I don't know how I feel about this. Um, his other favorite song is My Place. Let me see if I have that. <laughs> um, um, oh, I don't have My Place. Oh, okay, well, that's a little bit sad, isn't it? What if I play a different song for him? Should I play this? How many Hydrate Redemptions until it locks? Oh, it's on a timed cooldown rather than an amount. Um... I, I don't remember the amount of time, but it's on a timed cooldown. But I'll just have some more water. Um, I'll play Spring Blossoms for him. Um, there we go. Ooh, you guys make sure you're staying hydrated as well, please. Um, unless you're fasting, obviously. Um, but, uh, yeah, make sure that you're um, staying hydrated. He doesn't like a different song. <laughs> I'm not torturing Sherb. I'm, I'm branching out his taste in music. And Spring Blossoms is, uh, I knew, I knew you were gonna chime in with something else. <laughs> um, I actually don't mind this, um, just found a flaw in my story, gotta want to find a way to fix it. Good luck. Hydrate taste nuts, Oreo. <laughs> um, this is not a bad layout, though. Um, <laughs> you should branch out your taste. I mean, you're probably right, I could, but, uh, that's okay. <laughs> um, I don't mind this, um, I don't mind this, like, layout of the furniture. I might change the, the color of the log stuff to be the, like, the white, the white birch. Um, maybe? I'm gonna change the colors. Um, and then I'm also gonna change the floor and the, um, the floor and probably the, um, probably the walls as well. I was gonna say the ceiling. You can't change the ceiling. Um, but yeah, the, uh, when you move in a lazy villager, their, uh, their house always looks like this. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna keep this pot, but we'll, uh, we'll see. And I could keep the peach chair, but the peach chair only comes in, uh, white peach or... <laughs> White peach or yellow peach? What? Rude what? Which bit? About the, f the floor and the wall? <laughs> Sabertooth tiger and the uh, hy hyena don't have no modern day descendants. Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess you could sort of look at like what would be like most closely related. Oh, no. Sh I didn't <laughs> no, sure. It's got the personality type lazy. I didn't call him lazy. The game designated him as a lazy villager. Guess what? What? 
Is it gonna be D's nuts? I need to fix the camera for next stream also because I'm like way too low in the frame. Like this is me sitting like straight, like completely up. <laughs> Same to you, Oreo. You perpetuated the stereotype. I mean, I suppose I did. I suppose I did. I don't think, I don't think Sharp is lazy for real. Um, that's just what the game, uh, that's just what the game decided he is. Um, do we want to keep the, the peach accents? What do we think? Unsure. Unsure. Um, I don't know if I want this either. Um, I might get rid of that for now. Let's, um, let's give him a bit more kitchen furniture, um, rather than just the stove. Let's put in a, um, like a kitchenette of some kind, I think. Potentially, or at least the sink. Um, oh, do I have the sloppy sink? That's a cute one. The sloppy sink is a cute item. Oh, look, I do have it. Yay. Yay. Peach Peach has an accent. Does she really talk in an SMP game? I mean, she does have... She, 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 I, I suppose... I don't know that she does have an accent. Her voice seems pretty, like, neutral in that sense. Neutral, uh, neutral Western English accent. As in Western world, speaking English, not Western English. That would be like the Corn Cornwall Devon. She does not have a she does not have a Cornwall accent. Um, Oreo not doing a D's nuts joke. I mean, listen, you gotta gotta spice it up sometimes. I love um, the lazy villager type. Also, they're my faves. They're always they're making friends with the bugs. They're talking about snacks. I love them. They're my favorite. It's my favorite like, personality type. Um, okay, what I'm actually gonna do is swap this to be in front of the bed instead. Um, maybe put that on it. Um, and then I might get rid of this the peach chair potentially. Um, you even have friends who are lazy, right? I'm lazy. <laughs> I took a quiz, actually. I took a personality quiz, I think, where if I were an Animal Crossing villager, what personality type would you be? And I got lazy. Um, um, so, yeah. Uh, I'm going to grab this because I think it comes in like a nice, like, light blue color. Oh, no, it doesn't. It comes in that one. Oh, well, okay. That's fine. Um, okay. Now, what are we doing in terms of the layout? I don't know. Good question. Good question. Um, but what I think I want to do is... Hmm. Do we want to put, like, a couch here, maybe, instead of the bench? It just appropriate Sheriff's culture. <laughs> Sheriff's not the only lazy villager. <laughs> um... Okay, do we want to put like a, let's put the bench down the side actually. Oh, no stop, let's go sideways. There we go. Um, and then let's, do we want to do, actually do we want to do, do, do we want to just want to do two of these? Oops, oh my god. I could move, I could move it all out actually. Well, no I can't actually because this these are in the way. But in theory, if I move it out and then put the bench like on this side, maybe, and then we can put something in the corner like a lamp or a plant or something. Um, now, see, I'd like to sort of go with Sherb's like sort of bluish theming. I don't know that I want to include this peach chair, although I suppose this blanket has like a bit of like a sort of red on it, so maybe it'll be okay. I don't know. Um, let's put... Now, something that's really sad is, um... The only, like, tiny bookshelf item is this one. There's only... <laughs> there's really only these two bookshelves. And this one's, like, really tall and, like, um... Quite... It's, like, two tiles, like, long. Or wide, I suppose. And then this little, like, tiny one, I don't like the colors that it comes in. <laughs> Like, I don't, I don't like these colors. So, I guess it's gotta be this one. I guess that, like, it's a little darker than the rest of the stuff, but it's probably okay. 
maybe. Classic Sims move, put a plant in every corner. Yeah! <laughs> Bookshelf, my old buddy. <laughs> um, I'm gonna swap the order of these, actually. I also might get a different. Does Sherb like the colors? Well, I don't know, but I, I can't ask him. <laughs> Sherb's whole default house is like um, purples and blues and stuff. Um, I'm trying to pull. I'm trying to pull in those um, as best I can. Um, what if we grab a different? Um, well, I would like to get different because um, you won't talk to him <laughs> because there's no means. Well, I'll I'll decorate it and then we'll see what he says. We'll see what he says. Um, I want a different chair, though, for maybe, because, like, the peach chair is cute, but, like, also, it's, it's pink. This is looking great. Thank you. It's mostly the way that it was before, but I just made some swaps, <laughs> but thank you. Um, okay, tell you what, I'm gonna put this here, and then it can sort of be, like, a side table slash bench, and then where are we gonna put this water dispenser? Maybe on the table? Perhaps. There we go. Um, we should grab a little snack for Sherb as well. What kind of snack do we think Sherb wants? Oh, let's grab this little Nintendo Switch light as well. I'm sure Sherb will be kind and encouraging because he's better than some people. I mean, you're definitely right that Sherb will be kind and encouraging. Um, I, uh... <laughs> that's, 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 that's true. I, uh... Listen, I love Sherb. I don't I don't know like where our wires have gotten crossed that you that you think I don't I don't like him. Sherb wants Sherbert. I mean that would make sense. I don't know if there is Sherbert. There's ice actually is there even ice cream? There's milkshakes. I I could get him a milkshake. I don't have any I don't have any Sherbert. Uh, I've got smoothies and then I've got like cakes and stuff. Popsicles, pies and tarts, and cupcakes. Um, yeah, I don't have any sherbet. Um, unless it's in the, like, other items. We can pretend. We could pretend. Oh, there's these things. But I don't know what happens when you place that. It's just kind of, like, standing up. <laughs> That's quite small. Let's get him a better, a, a bigger, a bigger snack than that. Um... Do we want like some, like a, like a tart or like a cake or some, some, some cookies, frosted cookies? I don't know. I don't know. Um, tell you what I do want though, is the, where is that item? The one, the like little snack bag or, yeah, <laughs> thanks Oreo. Oh no, I don't know if I have it. Oh shoot. Shoot. I don't think I have it. But it's um it's like a little um it's like a bag of well, I think the default is like a bag of chips, but there are other like um skins that you can put on it essentially, but I don't think I have it. <laughs> Just like I'm a bookshelf. I'm a cute bookshelf. Thanks. I'm a snack bookshelf, sorry. <laughs> you didn't say cute. Um thanks though. So, okay. I don't have that item. This is a little bit sad. I was, cause I was gonna, I was gonna lean into the, um, the lazy vibe and put that on the floor. What I might do is put some socks on the floor, you know, for decor, because, um, can I like, oh yeah, look, I can just do that. Everyday socks, sure. Um, do we want to do that? Yeah, I think so. Should we put this by the bedside table? I say by the bedside table. It's on the bedside table. Um, let me grab some, uh, cushions to go on that seat. What patterns does this come in? Okay, there's like a couple. So we could grab like blue with flowers and like the denim, although I don't really like the colors that those are in quite. Like, it's not quite the right blue for me. Um, 
Yeah. But if we grab the other cushion, we could maybe, um, we can put that in the Abel Sisters patterns, which might be like a, a slightly better blue. We could do like this little checked one. Kind of, maybe? Maybe. Let's see what other ones we've got. Cause we have the whole, uh, oops. We have the whole Abel Sisters patterns. Um, um, okay. Do, 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 do. Oh, this one with the birds is kind of cute. Um, I'm gonna get like a few different ones and put them on the, um, on the, the two benches. Oops. Um. But I'm just trying to see what there is that's like bluish, you know? Well, so there's this one with the pizzas. Um, and this like sort of tropical hibiscus one. Um, or this one's kind of tropical-y too. And then we're back at the beginning. Okay. Hmm. Um. I don't actually like this gingham one. Maybe we'll get two, um, two, two, uh, bird ones. Oops. And then... Might grab a plain one. I'm gonna fix the lighting as well, because the lighting is not, uh, not the best. And then, um, oops, nope. <sighs> and then we could do, um, like this spotted kind of one, maybe, or, um, hmm. Maybe the pizza? No. Oops, I didn't mean to get rid of it. Oops. Oopie, oopie, oops. That's okay. Oh, I will hydrate. Good idea. Thank you, Oreo. You guys make sure you're staying hydrated too. And stretch and posture check. Flaps into chat. Hi, Calmly. Welcome in. How are you doing? Happy Thursday. Hope you're having a good day so far. Miss message. Uh... Uh, just realizing that having Wolf and Known using the DNA of modern descendants was stopping others from doing the same. Well, but just because like they, someone else has access to the things that they're using doesn't mean they have the like abilities to, you know, I suppose. I think, because from the way that you described it, it's sort of like a, it's like a power that they have essentially. Um, right? So, oh, good reminder from Nightbot. Thanks Nightbot. I'm gonna take this off also. Uh, okay, been keeping my Stardew modding guide up to date as mods update and change. Oh, that makes sense, Kamala. Yeah, like with the big update that came out. Oh my god, speaking of Stardew, guys, I have exciting news. Um, mod and friend of the stream, uh, Honey Field Notes, uh, has gifted me a copy of Stardew on the, on the PC. So I have Stardew on the PC now. Um, so I'm gonna be, uh, I'm gonna be playing that soon, I think. Um, to be able to play the new update and stuff. And hopefully get some mods as well. Um. Tee hee 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 hee. Stardew, yes. Exciting times. Uh, would you like my guide? Yeah, I'm yeah, I'm down. Feel free to feel free to send it over if you want. Um, if you're are you in the Discord? I can't remember. Uh, I can't remember. But yeah, feel free to. I can if you want to post it in chat. I can uh, I can give you a permit. Um, just let me know so that I can do it when you're when you're ready. Um, rut row, Raggy. What happened? What are you rut rowing? Uh, no, I don't use Discord. That's fair enough. That's fine. I just couldn't remember. Um. Yep, okay, I'll give you a permit uh, so that you can send that. There you go. Oh, right, yes, you need me. That's a good point, Nightbot. You're right, you're right, you're right. My bad. <laughs> you need to know what user. There you go. <laughs> uh, that reminds me, I meant to ask uh, Charlie if you had any luck setting up the permit thing. Um, Stardew Valley Mods Guide. Excellent, thank you, Calmly. Let me open it up. Um, also, I don't want to call anyone out of Lurk, so... Okay, it's, it's, oh, there we go, cool. Um, that's fancy, the permit thing. Um, yeah, I, uh, I swapped from Twitch, uh, doing my link moderation to Nightbot doing it so that I could do permits. You have an attempt again, oh, that's cool. Um, oh, this is a better blue for like what I'm going for, for what I'm doing, okay. Maybe we should get rid of the plain one then and put another Gangnam one. What do we think? That's kind of cute, right? Um, that's, yeah, that's fine. I just remember. Hi, Macross. How you doing? Welcome in. 
I had the idea that Wolf would be able to resurrect prehistoric animals by physically using DNA of descendants use it in a machine. I feel like that makes the urban legend void. I mean, even if it's like technically something that other people could do if they have the technology, like that doesn't necessarily like mean that they have the technology or like, you know, they could be like missing some other component that means that they then like can't potentially. Um, it depends, it depends. It's your, it's your world. You build the lore in whatever way feels right. Um, let me grab a plant for that corner, I think. Um, and then, um, I, am I keeping the peach chair? What do we think? Um, what do we reckon, gang? Uh, sorry, I was just considering adding in, like, a little washer, but I'm not sure where it would go. Oh, it's not in commands. I'll Google. What, what are you trying to check? Oh, about the permit thing? Um, yeah, it's, it's not, it's not technically within the commands. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's in Nightbot here. I'll just open it up. Nightbot has an N on the front. I just start, started typing Nightbot. What do you mean log in to, with Twitch? Ah, oh, it's because it's the other PC. New PC hype. Um, so it's under spam protection. Down, when you just open Nightboard, at, uh, down on the left with like commands, giveaways, logs, etc. Spam protection. And then links is the only thing that I have it enabled for. New PC is, I mean, I haven't actually done anything to like, because this is the Switch, so it, it, this isn't actually like running any differently. <laughs> But good in theory, um, good in theory, and quieter than the other PC was. Um, so yes, um, figured out a new way, just need to figure out a way to explain it. Heck yeah, Percy. You're good buddy. <laughs> you have that, so you have links enabled. So then if you go to, if you press options next to it, I think, oh no, that's not where the permit thing is, I take it back. I thought that would be where it was, but it is not. It might already be enabled then, potentially. It might just be something that automatically gets turned on, but I'm not sure. Or no, commands default as well. They have default commands as well as, oh no, there's no default, oh no, default commands, there we go. Oh no, permit's not in there either. Okay, take it back. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, it might just be something that gets turned on automatically when you set Nightbot to do the links thing. I'm not sure. I fixed my hair also. Um, I'm not sure. I thought I thought that that was that, that that would be where it was, but seemingly not. But that's okay. That's okay. Um, but yeah, the new PC is new PC is good. Um, yeah, like I said, I haven't really done anything to uh, enable these signs. <laughs> um, I haven't really done anything to like test it, uh, like the the stronger power yet. So like my top today, nice color. Thank you. I've actually had this top for a while. Um, there's like some, uh, there's like some staining like at the bottom of it from, I don't know, years back. So I don't always wear it as much. Um, it's, it's a more like casual, like, uh, it's not like a nicer top for me in that sense because it has a stain on it. Um, but it's really comfy. It's from a company called Delia's, which I think has went out of business like a decade ago. So that, that's an indicator of how old it is. But yeah, it's really, it's really comfy and like, um like loose in the torso, um, which I like as well. Um, and you're saying it's a nice color, so thank you. Um, have a few cooking stands on some of mine. Yeah, yeah. This is like a sort of, I mean, I don't know what it's from, but it's like a sort of like, I don't know. I don't know, it could be anything, but. Um, I like your Haley today. <laughs> Thanks, Oreo. <laughs> Um, all right, I'm trying to put a plant in the corner. Uh, maybe the coffee plant, because that's got a little blue pot. That could be nice. Let's do that. It's a bit shorter and, like, skinnier than some of the other plants, so it doesn't fill up the space as much, but I think it's okay. Um, do, 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 do. Um, now, let's, uh, change the lighting and the floors before we move on to anything else. Um, I don't know what entry we're gonna want. Maybe let's just leave it as the dark one, actually. Um, okay, we don't want, like, bright white. That's too bright. I don't want to hurt Sherb's eyes with the, like, 
bright white overhead. Uh, so let us pick. So we've got like white furniture going on now. So what do we want? Maybe like, do we want to go like blue walls, do we think? The blue walls look very kind of greenish under the yellow lighting though. So I don't know. Um, oh yeah, there's this one with like the, the like strip, um, like stripes of like blue and stuff in it. That's kind of cool. There is a little bit of a pink in there as well. Um, song is getting drilled into my head. I'm not gonna be able to sleep later. It's so catchy. <laughs> um, I wonder if we kind of do it like this, although I am gonna change the lights back to the white uh, and then just turn them down a bit, I think. There we go. Um, so then that does actually have a little bit of the pink in it. So maybe we can keep the, maybe we can keep the peach chair. Um, what other peach items are there? Cause there's a couple craftable items from, for each of the different types of fruits. Um, I'm not sure. I think it's only, is it just like three of each? There's a peach rug. There's a peach surprise box, which is what was in here before. And then the peach chair, I think. Still really like the 3AM remix by Curly. Oh, I don't think I've heard that. It's so danceable. That's presumably the 3AM Animal Crossing, but a remix of it, you mean? I can't I... believe you've done this. Who, me? <laughs> I like this flooring, actually. This is good, because then we get like a bit of a bit of color, but it's still like a wood, so it's like a bit like, still kind of natural, but like it pulls in the colors and stuff. 3AM from Animal Crossing, but like a, but a remix of it. That's cool. Let's put a rug down also. Um, do, do, do. See, now I like these rugs. Oops, that I accidentally scrolled before I... Uh, I like these rugs, but that's a really like a big rug. That's gonna take up like the whole space pretty much. And then you can't see our cute flooring. Um, so what I think we wanna do is, well, we could grab a striped, wait, where's the, there we go. I was gonna say the mom's items are cute. The mom's kitchen mat items, they're really cute. They come in like four colors. Um, and then do we want like, yeah, like a sort of like white mat or potentially maybe? Cause we don't want your feet to get cold, you know? Um, that seems okay, I think. Do you say mom or mum? Um, it depends, to be honest. Uh, I kind of fluctuate between the two. Um, I would, I would call my mother mom, but I might refer to her as mum sometimes, or sort of a mix of the two, like a hybrid. Um, I, I call her mom, but I might refer to her as my mum. I don't know. I think I think more often than not, I say mom. Uh, huge thing in Stardew, you can now no longer pick up carpets if something is on it. Used to be so annoyed by this. By picking them up if, if it was like underneath something. Well, that's good, I suppose, that they've... Uh, that makes sense that you wouldn't be able to pick it up if there was something on top of it, so... Um, yeah. Um, I think that's that's good. Um, let's put a little item by the door. Um, just a little miscellaneous item and then we'll put a, some wall decor on as well. Um, what do we want to put by the door? Some, hmm. I actually decided I don't like these cookies also. I'm gonna put something else there instead. I don't know what, but something. Oh, I could put the snack bread or the savory bread. Hmm. Do, 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 do. Or like, yes, I was gonna say something peachy, potentially. Although that gets kind of washed out. Peach pie? That still gets kind of washed out. I wanted something that wouldn't get washed out against the, uh, against the, the table. The pear tart kind of works because it's on that blue plate. And also I do have a lot of pear trees on the island, so that kind of works, I think. Um, and then we want something to go by the door. I don't know what though, but something. Maybe a little lamp? That would make sense because there's a reading thing just there. So yeah, maybe a little, a little lamp. I don't know what kind though. Um, like, do we want a little like um, a little candle, or we could do the like the Nova light that comes in a few colors. 
What do we think? I'm actually gonna swap the order of these just because of the um, the blue and the blue. Like, I didn't want the two blue things next to each other and then the, the pink chair on the end. So I'm gonna swap them like that. Also, because it's because the bookshelf with the light on it is taller than the chair. Um, so let's maybe do that. Um, yeah, I'm glad that they've, that makes sense that they've changed that about the rugs. Um, very sensible, I think. Um, okay. Do, 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 do. Uh, let's grab an... I really like the color this alarm clock comes in, actually, so I am gonna grab it. I'm gonna put the switch on the floor. Oops. I'm gonna put the alarm clock on the, uh, nightstand. And then I wanna grab a, um, yeah, like a little book. Best way I can explain it, uh, to resurrect a prehistoric animal, wolf, uh, and then later no one must think of the animal and nothing else. Chant this one phrase over and over until the animal appears in front of him. That makes sense. That makes sense. Very sort of cinematic. Um, constantly trying to move furniture and got the carpet instead. Yeah, I can imagine that would be very annoying. That's probably happened to me as well, to be honest. I haven't, uh, done a whole lot of decorating in Stardew, but I'm sure that's happened to me as well, and I've been annoyed by it. Um. Um. I'm putting items on the floor for decoration purposes. Um, let's maybe put this, like, maybe this? I don't know. Yeah. Maybe Sherb's crafting. Do we want to do it like this type? Do, 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 do. Sure. Okay, let's put us some ceiling and then uh, some stuff on the walls. Um, what kind of, hmm, what kind of light do we want for this? Shaded pendant lamp or this one, the wooden pendant light? I like to use this one a lot because I like it. Um, hate doing that IRL. I do it all the time after dinner. I go to take the plates to the kitchen. All of a sudden, I'm a film magician. <laughs> Hee -he. What do we think of this light? Is that in the middle? I think it is. Or should we do, like, um, hmm, I don't know. I'm actually gonna get, I'm gonna get an ornithopter, because I know that the, the lazy villagers like to, like to play. Um, or I know an ornithopter is not, like, really like a toy as such, but that's okay. Um, and then... I might want a different light though. Does this come in like a, like a white? No, it does come in blue. That's, is that gonna be a lot? It's kind of a lot. Yeah, ornithopter. Um, okay, wait, wait. This did come in like a light wood though. That might work. Love the concept of ornithopters. Yeah? That's fair, that's fair. I don't know a whole lot about ornithopters. Um, but we've got one. Um, a little ornithopter model. Um, oh, actually, maybe that was a good one. Maybe we should do that. What do we reckon? We could put in some uh, hanging glowing moss as well. That comes in a few colors as well. Turquoise blue. White and gray. Helicopters that have wings that flap. That is cool. Um, they were used in the Dune series. Oh, interesting. Okay. Um, I haven't seen any uh, any Dune Dune stuff. There we go. And then we've got some like decor above the bed. Should these be blue or no? I'm gonna leave them as the white. I think. All right. Now let's grab a few wall decor items. Um, I don't want to go crazy. Um. We will put a few things in the kitchen. Um, like, um, yeah, the, the pot rack and the hanging knife rack and stuff. Maybe the stainless steel. Or I guess actually we could get away with the, um, the wooden one because of the wooden floor. Yeah, I think so. I think that would work. Maybe. 
Do, 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 do. Um, and then this, I always end up using like all of these um, wall mounted uh, kitchen items because they're all so cute. <laughs> um, so I really like using them. No, see the wood on these is like too dark, I feel. Maybe. Well, I guess it's okay. Mm. Eh, I think it's fine. All right. Love Dune. Do you know the Command and Conquer video games? No, I do not. There was a Dune game of that type shortly before CNC came out. I played that a lot. Oh, cool. Nice. It's nice. Oof. I'm trying to scoot my chair forward. Um, let's grab a... Do we want to use a cherry blossom wall clock? Or we could use the cute clock. Or we could use an orange. No, I don't think the orange would be in coming good colors. We could put this in. Honestly, we could put them both. Double clock. Um, double clock, I think. Uh, I used to play that game on old acorns in school. What's what? Do, what do you mean on old acorns? Um, but fair enough. Fair enough. Um, we'll pop in a light switch, and then we'll just do like a little. Uh, just put like, um, yeah, coconut wall planter sounds good. We will just put that over here, I think. Acorn is an old computer company. Oh, okay. Um, then for things like gargoyles, wolf known, just simply have to touch it. That's fair, that's fair. Acorn was a British computer manufacturer. They had a good grasp of the education market. Oh, okay, cool. Fair enough, that, fair enough. Well, that explains why I haven't, uh, haven't heard of them. Maybe they uh, they weren't in North America, or maybe they were, and I just didn't uh, pay attention to who manufactured the uh, the school computers. That's very possible as well. Um, um, but fair enough. Thank you for letting me know. Let's do it like this. Yeah. Okay. Um, and we'll put. Uh, let's maybe put a little cork board up. That'd be cute. Um, I don't know what design to put on it, though. I don't have any that would be, uh, that would be good as flags, so it's just gonna have to be one of these, I think. Um, or I guess I could put an Able Sisters one. Um, do, 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 do. Where did that fish one go? Or birds, sorry, it was birds. Let's do that. Um, they made very little inroads of the UK, Oz, New Zealand market. That's fair, that's fair. Good reminder from Nightbot also. Thanks, Nightbot. I'll have some water. Okay. Uh, Acorn, Ar Ar is it Archimedes? I always struggle with that one. Family of personal computers designed by Acorn Computers of Cambridge, England. Systems are based on Acorn's own ARM architecture processors and the proprietary operating systems Arthur and RICOS. Got you. Um, first models were introduced in 1987. Systems in the Archimedes family uh, were sold until the mid-1990s. Fair enough. Cool. Cool, cool. Oops. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's put one or two things in. Cause like I said, I don't want to go like overboard. Should we put some, what colors does the spooky garland come in? Cause I think the spooky garland is cute. Oh, that's nice with like the little like blue and pink. Should we do that? Yeah, that feels like cute and, and playful, I think. Should we maybe put like a, um, a starry garland in as well? A starland? Hi, Keza. Thank you for the quiet hello. Hope you're doing well. I have a small collection of those machines, so of course I unlocked at this point. <laughs> That's fair. Computers ran RACOS used to... You used to be able to mess with the memory allocation from the GUI. Oh, interesting. Hmm. That seems, uh... That seems, uh, risky. Um, Quincy... Uh, should I call you Quincy? Thank you for the quiet hello as well. Um... I hope you're, uh, I hope you're having a good day. No, that's weird with both. I'm just gonna leave it as the, the spooky garland, I think. Um. Nice joke. Oh, risky. Oh. 
That wasn't intentional. I thought that maybe was pronounced risk, but I wasn't sure, so I was just saying all the letters. Um, it was it wasn't intentional. I would love to take credit for that, but uh, it wasn't intentional. Um, do I want to put any of these in? No, I don't think so. Do do do. Oh, we could put some glow in the dark stickers, maybe. Hmm. It's a very catchy song, I think. No, I don't like that. I don't like that. Predated Windows 3.1. Um, I was going to say, where are my classics? They're here. Mom's art. I'm always using the mom's art items because, listen, they're, they're very pretty and cute, okay? You can't stop me. No one can stop me. Um, I just want something on this wall, but like just something small and simple. I don't know what though <sighs> Sure dried flower garland fine um, Oh, that's like in a nice blue Or is that gonna be too much against the blue wall? Mm. Maybe Hang on we're almost done we're almost done we're almost done do, 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 do. Uh, let's get an AC. That's probably that's probably important. Um, AC above the window? Sure. Alright, here we go. We're done. We're done. I'm calling it. I'm calling it. Um, hang on. Okay, now that we're not spending as much time in here, now I will go put Sherb's favorite song on. Um... Here we go. Sherb's favorite song is now playing. Uh, plan the exterior. There we go. Um, and we have that one now for like a little bit, but it's fine. It's cool. Uh, okay, so I want the the outside to be not blue. So let's maybe go white exterior but leave the blue door or something like that perhaps or yeah oh i could put a little uh, i could put a little wreath on it too ooh should we put the mum wreath on i think so mums are our native flower and also i really like the uh the mums um yeah let's do that or I could put a mushroom wreath on as well. No, let's do the... Or I could put a welcome sign. Mm, no, let's put the mum wreath. Mum wreath. So there we go. So we're, we're keeping the blue door. Blue door? Um, a la blue bar. Um, I'm just looking at all the different types of door. No, I think that's probably a good one. So there we go. So then we've kept a little bit of blue, but the outside's a little more more neutral to sort of blend in with the island a bit. Um, but the inside is much more sherb. Um, so there we go. Okay, cool. Yes. Done. There we go. Oh. That's not... Oh, I thought that would be how you finish. Oh, okay, that's fine. Um, what, let's just take a final look at this then. They've given us another opportunity. I think that's good. I mean, like, it's a bit more crowded than it was, um, but that's okay, because there's still, like, plenty of space to move around. Um, oh, wait, actually, you can't get to any of these seats. Maybe we should, uh, hmm. You actually can't get to any of those seats, so let's maybe move some stuff. Maybe? But you can't sit on them anyway because of the things. No, I think it's fine. I think it's fine. You can sit in the peach chair. All done. Stands for Reduce Instruction Set Computer. Got you. Okay. This means the commands set to the processor uh, are simpler compared to CISE com Complex Instruction Set Computer. Um, but the advantage is faster execution, lower power usage. That makes sense. That makes sense. That makes sense. Um, there we go. Next one. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Um, I keep <laughs> I keep beating the alerts to the punch because I can see the, the activity feed. Um, I have to figure out why there's such a delay on those now. Um, but thank you for the follow, friend. Uh, we do have anonymous follows. If you want to remain anonymous, feel free. Lurk away. We're very lurk friendly. Or if you want to make yourself known in chat, feel free as well. Whatever feels right for you. 
bastard is crying in it. <laughs> um, old apples used to use, uh, so is, do, do you say it as risk? Presumably. Um, but they used to use that. Oh, okay. Fair enough, fair enough. So in theory, apparently we can do, that did not in fact make sense. What, the thing that calmly said? I thought it made sense. Um, but it may, but maybe it doesn't to you, and that's fair enough as well. There's now an open source version of Risk CPU called Risk V. Okay. Typically pronounced Risk and Arm. That makes sense. That makes sense. Refer to that as old apples. <laughs> Use Apple when they had Motorola 68K processors. That was before they switched to PowerPC. Tech. <laughs> that's fair though. That's fair. That's fair. A residence home. Did you come up with some new design ideas either for an existing? Oh, so you can change one. I didn't know this was a thing, so I can change. Oh, so that's interesting. That's useful actually, because if you wanted to use a craft, like I was saying earlier, how if you want it, if you want the crafted items to be in your Happy Home Paradise catalog, you need to have crafted some of them before. Sometimes they get, they show up anyway for, it depends on like what you've unlocked, but some of them you need to have crafted them. But that's interesting. So then you could start your build and then if you needed to go away and like get something, then you could continue as long as it was the same day. Interesting, interesting, okay. Um, remember in teen years I was obsessed with learning about prehistoric animals like dire wolves, saber-toothed tigers, hyena dons, terror birds, etc. That makes sense, yeah. There's a lot of cool, um, um, uh, particularly the megafauna, um, m most of which have, uh, have, d have, d have gone, have died out. Um, but, um, yeah, that's fair enough. So that's interesting. I didn't know that. So that's a fun feature. Okay, so if you've if if anyone is doing Animal Crossing home renovations and you've gone in to do one and then realized you wanted an item that you didn't have, um, as long as it's the same day, you can leave, you can finish it and then go back. That's good. Interesting. Okay. If it's prehistoric land or sea, then yeah, I was interested. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. A lot of cool animals in the world. Um, I'm gonna finish my coffee as well. So my plan is to hopefully knock out like two or three of these um, in a stream. <laughs> Let's do the exterior first so that I don't have to come back to it. Um, so Ketchup's exterior right now is like a red building with a yellow door, which is kind of a lot. Um, so what I think I want to do is maybe do a red door with like a more plain exterior. Maybe like a... No, I don't like the beige. Maybe white, I'm not sure. Really big fauna tend to go that way or die off, yeah. Believe though that life tends towards smallness slash averageness in size to last, yeah. Yeah. Um, oh, what about this? This kind of works, I think. I'll look at the different like types of door, but I would like a red door, I think, to sort of keep ketchup's, um, or we could do, we could also do yellow. Oh, do we want like the rustic door? Or, hmm. Are you asking why to, are you saying that to Percy? Or are you saying that to me? Because if you're saying it to me, I don't remember what I said that that's, that that's a response to. <laughs> um, but I'm going to assume for now that you're responding to Percy. Um, maybe the window door? Yeah, got you. Got you, got you, got you. Um, oh, or the lattice work door? They're all slightly different shades of red, but that's just something we have to live with. Let's go for this. We... Oh, that's called orange stone roof. I mean, it's not that orange. It's it's pretty like it's pretty it's pretty beige to tan, I would say. But um, that's okay. I think that works, though. I think that's good. Um, cool. Because of it. Oops, I pressed the wrong button. Do I, oh, confirm. I was, I thought it was plus. In my head, that was the sort of muscle memory that I wanted to do, but then I was looking at the buttons along the bottom. Have a good lurk, calmly. Um, yeah, but it was plus. I just was looking in the wrong place for it. Because of the big K9 teeth and muscular build. That's fair, that's fair. Um, yes, let's do the interior. 
Now, like with Sherb, Ketchup is one of the original three villagers, so she doesn't have her um, original home design. She has this sort of simplified one. Um, but she does at least have some music playing already, so that's good. I'm gonna assume that that is already her favorite song. This is the one that the peppy villager, your first peppy villager gets, which is a lot, in my opinion, this is like the sort of cutest and nicest one of the, uh, the first three. Uh, you'll see if we get to Stella's today or if we get to it next time, um, that that one also is like pretty, like, pretty plain this one at least is like you know it's got the florals and it's like a little it's like a little nicer but we are still gonna make it a bit more like um uh a, a bit more personal i think so let me see what ketchup's house looks like okay so she's got like a sort of hmm okay let me show you hang on welcome back welcome back i will show you so if any of you have uh, have seen my YouTube videos, you'll know uh, how I feel about ex ex like house interiors that are designed to look as if they're the outside. I don't like that because <laughs> I'm like, this is your house. Like, why are you, you you have the whole island like to to be outside and you like you know. So I, I'm not gonna be making her house interior look like the outside because I don't like that. But you can see that she's got a sort of like outdoor, like, camping-y, picnic, barbecue kind of thing going on. Um, I do like that she's got the stone pizza oven. I might include that, um, potentially. And this little, like, soup, uh, soup kettle, I think it's called as well. Um, and you can see the house exterior, which we just changed. Um, okay. Okay. I can work with that, I think. I think. Um, this is very spring though, this, I'm not gonna leave it as is, but this is very, uh, very springy, uh, by default, in my opinion. So I don't know how much I'm gonna change. Cause see, now my problem is that, like, to me, red is more of like a summer or fall color, um, because of the sort of, like, like the punch that like red has, you know, it's a very like sort of bright and deep and deep color a lot of the time. Where oh hi, Joseph's here. Oh, you going again? Okay, bye. He came to weigh in and then he he left. <laughs> uh, still love the fact that Earth was ruined by creatures that we don't see today. Yeah, that's really that's really interesting and cool. Wild to think sometimes. Um, but yeah, to me, red is more of like a summer and fall color, um, because of how, like, punchy it is. Um, whereas something like, well, like red versus pink, for example, pink is a lot, like, softer and more spring, in my opinion. Um, so I'm a little wary of going a sort of, like, red route for the color scheme. Only because I would still like it to be springy, you know? Um, so I might keep some of, a lot of this the same. Potentially? I'm not sure. Um, we do need to give her uh, some, uh, some, some kitchen furniture though. Um, I do like this loft bed also, so I, might, I am gonna keep that, I think. Um, now, am I keeping? Hmm. All right, tell you what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna grab the ranch kitchen item um, Mr. ADHD Games, I want to get a loft bed for my daughter. Oh my gosh, love that. Um, how are you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, I, um, I had a loft bed when I was younger, uh, and I really liked it. It was, uh, they are adorable, I agree. And very useful as well, like, in terms of the space. Um, I think. Um, but, um, but yeah, they're, uh, they're very useful, um, I think. Um, yeah, I had one in my room was, um, like, uh, sort of, uh, like bright green walls, essentially. <laughs> um, but yeah, loft beds are, are really cool. Um, um, sorry, all good. I was, uh, I was looking at ketchup stuff again. Um, if you do end up getting one, I hope that uh, I hope that your daughter enjoys it. Um, but yeah, how are you doing, Matt? It's good to see you. Always wanted one, but I had a bunk bed. Were you? Did you at least get to go on the top bunk and then you could pretend that it was a desk underneath you? 
<laughs> um, but yeah, they're really useful for like for like space. They have one with a slide on it. What? That's cool. That's cool. That's really cool. I want a slide. Um, doing well. I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad to hear. Um, not too bad so far over here. I'm very tired. Yeah, not morning for me. No, it's uh, it's two. It's like two forty in the afternoon. <laughs> Um, but yeah, not too bad over here, I would say. Um, I'm pretty tired. Um, I haven't been sleeping super well, but that's okay. That's all right. Um, I'm just here chilling today. Um, I'm glad you're doing well, though. That's good to hear. Um, yeah, I'm just, just redoing some Animal Crossing houses, so nothing, like, too, uh, too taxing, which is good. Um, now, do we want to keep the wooden block furniture? Maybe. Maybe. Hmm. Hmm. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this vacuum cleaner also. Um, now. What kind of layout do we want to go for? Maybe something like this. And then we'll put a little stove over here. Oh, she had this in her... I did say I maybe wanted to use this. Because she had this in her, um, in her default one. Let's maybe use that. Um, I'm gonna put it in the corner. And then this can sort of go, like, next to it, I guess. Oh, see, it's like one and a half tiles wide, which is, like, kind of annoying, but... That's okay. It is what it is. Um, tan one looks great in there. This one? Yeah, it's, um... Uh, yeah, yeah, I like I like that it's got like a couple different colored bricks in there, so it's not just like all one color. Um, I don't like that it's one and a half tiles wide, but <laughs> that's okay. That's fine. We'll make do. So I could move this over and put something else here, but I don't know what I would put. Um, you're off to bed because tired. That's very fair, Percy. I hope you sleep well. Thank you so much for hanging out. Um, lovely to see you as always. Um, get some good sleeps, and we will see you again soon. Um, let's put a fridge. Um, maybe the one with the cute stickers on it? Because I always do that. Because they're cute! They're cute stickers, you know? Um, we do then need to move this, though. I mean, I'm changing the layout of this one quite a bit, but that's okay. Good oh, excuse me, good reminder from Nightbot. I can have some more water. Um, see you next time, hopefully with more of my Urban Legend story. Well, heck yeah. I hope you're able to, uh, to, to work some stuff out for that. Um, and yeah, get some good sleeps. We'll see you soon. Okay. We'll probably put something in the decorative in the corner, like a plant or something, or... Maybe a little... Well, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Um, but what I think we want to do is... Do we want to keep this music system? I'm not sure. Not sure, to be honest. There's a lot of the wooden block furniture in here. I also don't know how I feel about this flooring. I know this is like similar to the one I just used in Sherbs, but I don't like it with the wallpaper. It's like slightly too busy for me. Um, so I might put on like a different, um, yeah, like something a little more neutral. Like the herringbone or the, is this pronounced parquet or parquet? Because it looks like it should be pronounced parquet, but I, I don't know. Um, so let me know if, if you're, uh, if you're, if you're in the know. Um, yeah, maybe that one or the herringbone. I guess it just depends on the color. The, the, the light wood of the ranch kitchen is the, like, more similar in color to this one. But I think I prefer this floor. Um, thank you so much for the follow. Um, welcome in. Glad you're enjoying the stream. Uh, if you would like to make yourself known, feel free. Or if you want to uh, lurk uh, and remain anonymous, then feel free as well. This word, um, par parquet or, or parquet. Uh, or neither. Maybe it's pronounced completely differently. I'm not sure. Um, but this word, um, not light and not flooring, the one in the middle. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just not sure. Um... But yeah, I think I want to go for this flooring, though. Um, let's turn the lights up a tiny bit. Um, so Ketchup is a peppy villager. There's actually a few peppy villagers on this island. I want to say three. 
Um, and they're sort of like, um, they essentially act like, uh, they're going to be the next big, like, pop star, basically. Um, so yeah. Um, parkour! <laughs> Maybe it's flooring that climbs on stuff. Like, floor that, like, goes, like, all the way up onto the ceiling or something. In Dutch, it's parquet, but that's not useful for you. I mean... Uh, maybe we pronounce it parquet. It looks like it looks like it comes from French to me, which is why I'm trying to maybe pronounce it parquet, but it could just be parquet. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I've never been in a context where I've had to pronounce it. Well, sorry, no. I, I've never been in a context where I've heard other people pronounce it. Oh, I have pronounced it. Actually, in like one of my first videos, I think. Or maybe not one of my first, but in one of the renovation videos I did, I used it and I, uh, I had the same thing where I was like, I don't know how to pronounce it. It's fine though. It's cool. Looks up the Indian Pale Ale. I'm kidding. I don't think you mean I IPA in that sense. <laughs> or maybe you do. Why was I about to go for the keyboard? I'm not playing a keyboard game. I'm playing on the Switch. Silly old me. All right, now. <sighs> I don't, I like that wallpaper though. That's, that's cute. So let's go for like International Phonetic Alphabet. I, f I figured you didn't mean Indian Pale Ale. <laughs> um, Dictionary.com says neither. It's pronounced parquet. Oh, it's not pronounced parquet. It's pronounced parquet. Ah, par parquet. Okay, interesting. Parquet. I did say that it could be neither of the ones that, that I that I was originally going with, and I was right. I wouldn't have known. No, me neither. Parky. I'm gonna get rid of this also because as cute as it is, it it it's kind of I I, I don't know I, I don't know if it's quite the right fit for like inside. What I actually want to include is the cherry blossom branches, but the problem with the cherry blossom branches is they're such a big item. It's like a two by two item. Don't ask me why, it just is. Or it's like one and a half maybe, because that's a half square. Maybe it's one and a half by one and a half. But it's 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 large, so like it kind of works here, I think. Wait, what? I'm waiting. <laughs> um, do we want to keep the craft table? I think we should. Um, this is the like, we could put a different craft table in though. Potentially. Um, there's like a couple different ones that we could get. Although they're craftable items, so I don't know if it will let me put them in if I haven't crafted them. Like I was saying with some things. Oh no, there's, some of them are here. Oh, but not all of them, because there is a cute one. It's using parquet to mean I would phonetically describe... Oh, to mean what I would phonetically describe as parquet. Oh, interest. Ah, uh, okay. Hmm. The jury's still out. Is that what they say? That's what they say, right? Well, I guess it should be the mini DIY workbench. Okay, well, maybe we'll keep it. We could, like, put a little rug under it just to break it up from the floor. Um, and I likewise, I guess we can keep this. Um, okay, we need a chair for this, but I didn't like the chair that was in there before. It was, like, the diner chair. I don't really like the diner stuff that much, but that's just a personal preference. Um, but that's just the default peppy home chair, you know? Helps it has an audio button too. Ah, now what does, so, so does the audio one say what, what you would describe more as par parquet? Um, this comes in like a pink, I think. Yes, pink. Oh, but see, it's like a different pink to the, oh, maybe I am changing the wallpaper, but like I'll keep, I'll try and find something similar, like a sort of, well, a wallpaper as opposed to something else, I suppose. Parquet. Okay. So kind of how the way I'm saying it as well. Oh, no, I don't want that. Not this wallpaper. <laughs> um, yeah, like a stripes wall or a blossoming wall. Huh. Okay. Parquet. Got gotcha. you. Um, or, or like these ones, actually. These are... Oh, that's a lot of pink, though. Uh... Uh, these are cute though, especially like there's a little strawberry one and a little like flower one. 
Okay. What do I think of this wallpaper, but potentially excluding the cherry blossoms because that's kind of a lot of pink like on top of it? Or what do we think of a yellow wallpaper and then leaning in with pink accents? Is the yellow too much with like the light wood though? Is it like too much of too samey there? I might change the color that this is also. I was gonna say it's white, comes in a white, also comes in a pink, but that's like a very bright pink. That's his, it feels like it's gonna be a lot. The P in spy and the A in trap and the R like notre, and the K like sky, and the E like best. Be, eh, parquet, parquet. What? No, but no T. Par parquet. What? I'm confused. Um, okay, well, I don't like this bed. I like the yellow better than the pink. But I worry that with the, um, the yellow is kind of, it's too, I don't like it quite with the, that's beige-ish light wood tone. But we can hopefully try and split it up enough. Um, I think. No T, yeah. Gotcha. Park, park, park. Parquet. Like that? <laughs> Am I doing it right? Um, yeah, I was gonna say, we can change the color that this is. Let's put a pattern on it. Um, just like me? Which bit? Oh, no T, just like me. Yeah, 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 gotcha. <laughs> um, uh, what color? Hmm, what do we want to do with this? Unsure. Unsure. See, I would like something kind of neutral so that it's like decorative, but not a lot. I mean, that, that pink feels like it's gonna be kind of too much. Well, I guess it's not the worst, but I don't know. Oops. Oh, no, that's not what I want. Um, I guess I could do like a, no, I don't like that. I don't like that. Is the E really like in best? No longer, it's a longer E. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. <laughs> um, gray stripes or no? I'm trying to like I'm like I said I'm trying to pick one that's sort of like uh, patterned but isn't gonna like clash. So nearest approximation in IPA help. That's fair. That's fair. Um, cause we could do like a sort of plainish pattern like something like this. Mm. Eh. Or, I mean, this one looks like it's meant to look like snake skin, though. Or like something kind of reptile, you know? I mean, eh. That kind of feels like it's the best of the ones we've tried so far. So I'll leave it for now, I think. Um, now, what we want to do, do I want this music player? I don't know that I do, to be honest. Also, there's a big space in the middle of my room. I might put, I'm gonna put a little table and chairs in the middle, I think, um, because I have this problem, and I, I've definitely said this like loads of times before, but I constantly just like, I'm building around the, along the edges of the, like along the walls a lot of the time, and then the middle ends up like empty, <laughs> you know? But I'm gonna put a little table and chairs there, I think, and that'll hopefully work. There should be space to like move around it um, for the most part. I don't know how I feel about this music player because look, these items are all the same color and they're like next to each other. And I don't like that. I don't like that. But I do like the tiny bookshelf item next to the, next to that. I think, um, although what we could do is instead of the tiny bookshelf, that's not what it's called. It's called the like wooden block bookshelf or something like that. Um, but I'm gonna call it the tiny bookshelf and you'll know what I mean. What I might get instead is parquet, but the but that is a right, but that's a tricky one. Yeah, I'm gonna continue to say parquet and and hope that that is kind of close enough. Uh, now, what I want to do is this. There we go. Um, the upright organizer, but you can change the hi battle snail. Thank you for the quiet hello. I hope you're doing well. Oh, I need to respond to your email. I thought about that as I was like starting stream, and I was like, oh, I need to remember to do that. Um, I've got a busy couple of days, um, um, but thank you for the quiet hello. I hope you're doing well. Um, sending good vibes your way. On Wikipedia, it's that. <laughs> I don't know how to read, um, 
how to read those. Um, okay, what's like, oh, I could do like sunflowers. No, I wanna, wanna pull in a bit of the pink, I think here. Cause so there is a default one that I could use. Um, uh, hydrate, good idea, thank you, Techno. I will hydrate, you're starting to learn. I mean, it's a definitely a useful thing to, to, to be able to know. To, to be able to do, sorry, or or to know, not to be able to know. Okay. That reminds me, I finally started um, looking back at my BSL again um, for the first time in like, I wanna say like a couple of years um, that I've like had access to it and like not, oh, that's a good one. Cause it's, look, it's got little music notes on it. Um, yeah, for the first time in like, like a couple of years, I think, that I've like had access to it and like just not, um, not, uh, not looked. So, prefer the original pronunciations and words anyway. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. A Wikipedia said that's how it's pronounced in French, not in English. But like, if it's a word from French, like, we sh you know? Like, I say lieutenant, for example. Um, like, you know, if we've adopted a word from another language, like, I don't know. I don't know. And like jalapeno and stuff like that. I do sometimes like, um, I don't know. I do sometimes not quite pronounce it properly, but stuff like that. Um, we use the same short E sound in Dutch, but then again, we do pronounce the T. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. You can answer stream if you want to. Um, I am not uh, really in a financial position. Oh no, yeah, you don't. That's, yeah. There's no, there's no obligation to like, if we like chat about it and, and stuff, like there's no, you know. Um, yeah, no, I get you. I, 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 I totally get that battle snow. Um, like how people in English say emoji singular and in emojis plural. Um, but in Japanese, both are emoji. Oh, that makes sense. Like sheep. Um, so you just say emoji. That's fair. That's fair enough. It knows me when people say they want to catch all the Pokemons and aren't doing it ironically. Oh, that's fair. Yeah. That's fair. But I guess if people don't know, don't know any better, you know? Um, I get you. That's interesting. I didn't know that about emoji versus emojis. I say emojis with the S, I think, but I didn't know. Um, that's cool. Uh, now why did I like him in here? Oh, I was trying to look for other music players, but like a big, another big one like that. Cause there are small ones that we could like put on something, but it would be good. I think if we could put, oh yeah. So there's a couple like big ones. Okay. Like a jukebox. And, uh, okay. Oops. No, that's a copy machine. <laughs> I was trying to aim for the retro stereo. Oh, that just comes in black and brown. Okay, well, the brown would technically kind of work, but it would kind of be like a, I don't know. And then this is just gonna come in the wooden block colors. I mean, pastel kind of works. I don't love the purple though. Ah, I mean, I guess it's okay. Can I put something on top of that, do you think? No, sad. <laughs> That's okay. Um. Oh, hi. Wow, well-timed. The throne thing about sending you treats just popped up. Did you know? Hi. Do you want to come say hello? Yeah? I'm going to come up. Oh, oh, you got me right in the face. You can't do that. Ow. Oh, ow. Ow. Okay, I have to open the door for him. Hang on. How badly did you get my face? I don't think it was too bad. He like, he got, he like punched me with his, uh, big doggo think they small. I mean, it, he just, he doesn't have very good spatial awareness. Um, so when he's aiming for the shoulders, he sometimes will like hit us in the face with his, uh, his, his claws essentially. Um, so yeah, he'll like, uh, and we're trying to sort of like, we're trying to sort of like remark when it happens so that he like is a is, is being told that he has hit us essentially. 
So, thank you for getting the Joey command in also. Um, get the language of Volt when it's coming from exploited by the West cultures. Ed feels best most respectful to use their pronunciation slash word or near as possible in the meaning behind it. Yeah, that's fair, Conley. That makes a lot of sense, yeah. Thought you're building a new co-worker stream cozy setup uh, until I saw the cute critter. What? Oh, in, in this? I'm confused. I'm confused. Um... In, the, in in Animal Crossing, you mean? Until you saw Tom Nook? Is that what you mean? Otherwise, you get situations like we have now where Gen Z have words they claim are theirs, but are really stolen from black folks. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I know there's a lot of that. Um, particularly in, uh, in, in Western countries. Um, uh, it was probably an issue before Gen Z, too, yeah. But there's there's probably, like, a, a new wave of it happening, essentially. Yeah. Yeah, I get, I get you. I get you. Um... Like, cool. Oh, is that is that one that has been? I didn't know that one. That's actually an AAVE word. Oh, interesting. Oops, I didn't mean to press that. Um, oh, I didn't know that. Um, okay, are we getting rid of the tiny bookshelf? Yes. I think so. Am I doing cherry blossoms in the corner? I think so. My face still hurts a little bit. <laughs> it's okay. Um. Yeah, I didn't. Uh, I didn't know that. What am I after? Table and chairs. Do 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 do. I'm gonna assume that this song that's playing is Ketchup's favorite song. Also. Um. Generally, when they uh, have a default one going, it's uh. It's because that's their favorite one. Um, okay, I can't see now because this page won't scroll. Um, Neapolitan is her favorite song in New Horizons, apparently. I assume that's what's playing. I'm, I will double check now. Um, you don't know, just in general who's stolen lots of words and phrases? Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, Neapolitan, excellent. Okay, well, we'll leave that. Um, yeah, that's a good point, calmly. Um, yeah, I guess that's not really something a lot of people think about, myself included. Um, do we want to do this table, or... Oh, I could do the... Oh, well, I don't really want to do the orange end table, I don't think. I wish there were a cherry blossom table. Maybe there is, and I just haven't crafted it. That's very possible. Good reminder from Nightbot, actually. Thanks, Nightbot. Um, um, one that annoys me the most when f folks misuse habitual B? I don't know what that is. What is that? What do you mean? Um... Oh, it be like that sometimes. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. Um, I get you. Um, what kind of chairs do we want also? I don't know. I don't know. Like a cute one. I guess this could be a good use for the peach chair, actually. Potentially. Um, or the cute chair. Um, I don't know. Um, is that something else that's been sort of, um, habitual B is from A, V, E, and means someone does something habitually, therefore I think you can't say B and sometimes? Oh, I get what you're saying, I think, okay. What I'm finding it was specifically from the jazz world, which was indeed almost exclusively back at the time. Does that match your understanding? Oh, interesting. Hmm. I'll have to- I'll have to look into it. Um, something to look into, I think. Oh, I forgot that there was a pink- that there was pink ranch furniture also. Let me see what the ranch kitchen looks like in pink. It's probably- I feel like it's probably gonna be too much pink. Uh, mm, it's kind of a lot. <laughs> I'm not a very bold person. I guess ketchup maybe is, but... I don't 
know, I'm not very good at branching out. <laughs> and doing like bold things, you know? Um... I don't like this table though. Well, not that I don't like it, but I, I want something like a little more exciting, I think. Um, okay. Uh, not that though, it does be like that sometimes. It's also an Irish-English thing, and I cannot speak for the AAVE meaning, um, but in the Irish meaning, Irish-English sense, my understanding is that this is a sensible use. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll have to, I'll have to look into that. Um, none of these tables are very interesting, except for these ones, but these aren't, this is only gonna come in, like, yeah, red, blue, and, well, I say blue, it's white, but, uh, red, blue, yellow, essentially. And then this comes in those two colors. I mean, hmm. That's a bit more on the red side than the stuff I've been doing. I feel like there is a cherry blossom table, and I just don't, I haven't crafted it, so it's not in my thing. Um, this comes in a few, like, colors. Um, like a few different options. Eh. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Um, maybe let's just use the table I had before. I'll put some rugs down. Um. Is this how we want to do it? Or should we just do two chairs so that it's not like taking up too much of the space? Or is that weird in the middle of the room? I feel like with a lot of words uh, and saying that relate to multiple different cultures, the thing that matters is the context that they're used, especially as words that become widely used in general. It's actually an AEV master glossary out there that makes a list of uh, they list a lot of AEV words and their meanings. Oh, okay. Hmm. Yeah, I'll have to look into that. I'll have to look into it. Um, because there's definitely things that I say that I've probably just picked up from, like, them generally being used, um, but I don't necessarily know, like, their, uh, their origins. Um, so yeah, probably worth looking into. Um. Oh, look, I have the cherry blossom rug. That's useful. Um, and then I also want the... Oh, see, the lacy rug is cute as well, but I don't want to, like... There's no space, so that's so sad. Um... I don't want to, like... I don't know, I always use the lacy rug. Um... But, um... But, yeah. Um, this is all news to me. Um, learning stuff. Um... Okay, what do we think of this so far? I'm gonna put some more wall decor up, I think, but... I don't know how I feel about it, I'm just- I'm trying to, like... I don't know. Maybe we do the dim lighting, actually. And it's like, I don't know. Cozy. Cozier. I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> I'm very indecisive. Who put me in charge? I'm not sure I agree if they're appropriate and had their meaning changed by cultures. I still systematically oppress the cultures they came from. Yeah, I get you. Um, yeah, it's a tricky one. I think. I think. I don't know. Um, hard to know. Hard to know. Tough to know, I think. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna... That's, that feels like something that, um is worth, uh, reading up on a bunch, like, reading, uh, um, 
papers and stuff on it. Um, I think. Um, do, 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 do. Um, okay, let's grab some. Um, some decor. Um, let's grab a, like a, a mixer? Sure. Okay, well that wasn't where I would put it, but fine. <laughs> um, and then some, um, oh, maybe, hmm, hmm, yeah, like a little tablet would be good, I think little tablet device. I was gonna say, hopefully there's a pink case. Um, let's, sure, let's put some videos on there. Um, and, hmm. Okay, well, let me put the blender where I was gonna put it originally. Um, I was thinking about putting this on the desk, but then I was also thinking about putting the little makeup kit on the desk. Um, like that's maybe where she like does her makeup to get ready for the day. Cause she's a, she's a, she's a peppy villager. You know, they're into like fashion and glamor and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, that's why I'm, uh, that's why I'm, I'm doing that. Yeah, let's maybe put that up there and then the tablet can kind of go... I don't know, I guess the tablet could go here. Is that weird? Maybe we don't do that. Maybe I get rid of this and put the tablet on here instead. Um, and then, what do I want to put over there? Hmm. Great question, I don't know. I don't know. Um, oh yeah, like a sturdy paper bag. That's cute. That comes in like a little floral one, I think. Yeah. Floral print. Let's put that like over here. And then, oh, like a cute little like rotary phone. Does that come in like a pink? No, that's sad. I could put it in white, but then I think it would be like too much, too much white stuff. Um, um hmm. What do we want to put over there? Well, I could put a little cherry blossom, but I've already got a cherry, the big cherry blossoms. So that kind of feels like overkill. Um, does this come in a cute little pink? Feels like it should. It does not. That's so sad. Um, I don't need a music player because we've already got a music player. Well, I guess I could put some candles up there. Let's maybe do that. Yeah, that works, I think. Um, what do we think of this? Um, let me change the... Um, let's go for the white one and then, do we want to put a pattern on here? Probably, but what pattern? I don't know. Um, <laughs> Yeah, sure. Let's put that one on. There we go. Um, I don't know if I want this wreath. Well, it's probably fine. Okay. Now, let's put some wall decor up. Am I just going to put all the kitchen things in again? Very possibly. <laughs> Very possibly. Um, I'm going to put this above the window. And then um, let's put the wall shelf with bottles up. Um, oh, there's a yellow one. That's interesting. Um, is that going to be like too much yellow? Um, let's do that. So then it kind of like matches that white one that is, that is next to a little bit better. Um, okay. Let's put a light switch in. Do, 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 do. Oops, nope, that's a radiator. Um, wood grain or, no, let's do the white. Um, 
and let's put an AC. Oops, that's nope, that's a tower rack. <laughs> Uh, we'll pop an AC in, and now I have a couple of cherry blossom things in already, so do we do the cherry blossom clock to like keep that theme, or do we do the cute one? I think we do the cute one. Actually, both. <laughs> Did I put two clocks in the last build as well? Yeah. What are you gonna do about it? Um... Um, let's put this in colorful, maybe? Yeah. Actually, maybe that would be a good place for maybe not the dried flower garland. What if I put that there instead? We'll see, we'll see. But what I actually want to put there is a different type of garland. Um, well, probably not the spooky garland because it only comes in... Yeah, probably not good colors for this. Maybe the party garland, or maybe the starland. Um, yeah, that looks cute, I think. Kind of hanging above the bed there. Um, oops, nope, stop. <laughs> Just trying to move this. It's over here. Um... Oh no, I don't like the color of that against the wall. Hang on, I'm gonna change it to like the maybe white or maybe the pink actually. Cause that's that's pretty light then. Uh mm, I don't like this wreath now. Hang on. Let's put a different wreath there though, because I should have a actually oh I don't know if I'll have them. Oh I have some, okay. Ah, so we could do this mum wreath, which is like Slightly different colors. Let's do that. All right. What do we think of this? Let's put a light down in the in the middle. Sorry, I could hear speaking. I don't know if it was uh, just Jack like going into a meeting or something. Um. Hmm. Let's do the wooden pendant light this time. Okay, what do we think? I think it's cute. Looks pretty, uh, though crowded, but that's because this in this game the rooms are small. Yeah, you can't change the size of the, the villager houses. You can when you do like Happy Home Paradise, but not when you're doing the house renovations, which is a shame, because yeah, it's kind of a small space to like fit like a whole like living space into. It is a, it is a little bit crowded. Um, but uh, yeah, that's just, uh, I might actually get rid of one of those chairs just to make it like a slightly less crowded. Um, I mean, it's still kind of as crowded, but. It's like a slightly more space now. Um, technically, but yeah, it's, uh, yeah, it's, uh, I'm unfortunately limited by the, uh, the game doesn't let you, um, But um, that's okay. So there, if we do that, then we've got like a bit of walkable space. Um, there we go. Um, thank you for saying it looks pretty also. Um, I'm pretty happy with it. Um, all done. Okay. Um, am I gonna do Stella's today as well? I think so. Yeah. I think so. I'm gonna take a quick BRB before we do that though. Um, so, um, good opportunity for y'all to grab a quick break as well. Um, whatever you gotta do, stretch, give your eyes a break from your screens, um, refill your waters, have a snack, all that good stuff, whatever. You don't have to do all of those things, just whatever, whatever you uh, can and need to do. Uh, essentially, um, I will do the same. I will also um, run the ad um, uh, during that time. Um, so if you're not subscribed, you'll get an ad, but don't worry, it'll be finished before I'm back, uh, so you won't miss anything. Uh, and then we will do uh, another renovation. Hello. <laughs> oh, get a reminder for Nightbot. Hi, Nightbot. Um, 
Yes, thanks, Marie. <laughs> also, thank you so much for that follow. Um, a BRV follow. Uh, I'm glad you're enjoying the stream. Um, if you want to remain anonymous, feel free. Uh, we have anonymous follows. Uh, if you want to make yourself known in chat, feel free. Whatever works. Um, you would be hearing more behind you. That's true. If you woke up and suddenly your ears were backwards. That's, uh, that makes sense. That makes sense. Um, all right. Let's dive in. Um, let's talk homes. Um, a residence home. So, uh, this is, we're gonna be for Stella, who is the, a chain shop. Oh no, this is the same. I just put my sweater back on over the top. Um, I just put my sweater back on over the top because it's a bit cold. Um, so this is the third of the three initial villagers. So the last one that will sort of be a more simplified house design. Um, and as before, I'm gonna consult the web on what Stella's uh, regular house normally looks like so that we can see. Also her favorite song is Only Me. I'm just looking, cause they're two, uh, two different wikis. <laughs> Uh, just looking so that I can see. Um, oh, okay. Um, so... This is what her house normally looks like. Oops. Um, so, pretty similar to how I kind of do most of my houses, to be honest. Um, bed, storage, dining, that's just a sink, it's not really a kitchen, but you know, that's that's pretty similar to how I would normally like do mine anyway. Um, so yeah, okay, and you can see she's got a pretty sort of like beige-ish theme with like some little pink accents going on. Okay. Cool. Uh, I don't, th I, th I don't know that I'm gonna change the exterior of her house that much. Um, but maybe like slightly. She does have a purple, like a bright purple roof and like a dark pink door. So I am gonna change it a little bit, I think. Um, um, poten potentially? Um, oh, I don't know that I wanna go like a beige though. Um, well the pink, cause that's like a, yeah, I was gonna say that's like a pink logs. So the pink and the pink is kind of a lot. Burgundy door, okay, okay. Well, I don't mind the burgundy door. I don't love the sort of um, circular window, but I also don't know that there are gonna be other doors in that color. Um, hang on, I'm just gonna go right to the bottom. Yeah, not, probably not. Yeah, cause that's like a different, that's like purple, red, but that's red, not, uh, it's not quite the same. Um, yeah, okay. And then the pink. So maybe it has to be that, uh, how do they describe that door? Oh, they just call it the basic door. Okay, but it's got kind of like a, well, that's funny. That one's called green apple. Um, I don't like the circular window, but that, that might just, we might just need to make do with the circular window. Um, but yeah, I don't, I don't like the bright purple roof. So maybe we go, do we go darker or do we go? Cause that's, well, that's actually not as bad cause it was this one before. So it's like, this one is still purple, but like less bright. So that, that works like a little bit better. I think maybe let's, let's actually maybe do that. So then we're keeping the colors, but just like a little more, a little more muted. Oh, I forgot to put something on ketchup's door. Oh, I can still change it, right? I think I can still change it. Okay, someone remind me when we finish this one to uh, go back and add a door decoration to Ketchup's exterior. Um, do we wanna do the fancy mum wreath on this one or we could do, uh, I don't know. Well, I could do like a welcome one. Um, that's weird that it like exits that window. Um, yeah, let's do this and see. Oh, that covers that circular window actually. So that, <laughs> let's do, <laughs> let's do that. Um, Cause I was having problems with the window anyway. Um, yeah. 
I don't want to change them too much because I I don't you know I I'm trying to sort of keep them like they all have sort of like little distinct styles um and so I I, I want to sort of like I don't want to like erase those um but I also don't want them to like clash too much with the like the island exterior which is all like quite like soft colors so so yeah this is Stella's house um which like it's it's not too bad to be honest in terms of like the furniture that it's in and the layout but like it's a bit it's a bit plain so I might sort of keep it mostly as is and just sort of change oh no I didn't mean to get rid of that I meant to change the color I pressed the wrong button um but that's okay because I can just grab it again um um, but yeah, I, uh, I don't mind, I don't mind, I don't mind it, but I'm gonna change a bit around, I think. Um, what colors does the system kitchen come in? That, that bit that there is always black. The, the, um, the, the hood. Okay. Or we could do, um, individual items as well, potentially. We'll have to see. Um, oh, the base design tab includes her her home and her, and the one that, so it, it includes her regular design and this one. Um, okay. The cute music player is a nice item, so I might use that. Um, I think it was the song was Only Me or something like that. Um, only me. Interesting. Okay. Uh, now, what I want to include is the sewing project. Yeah. Um, maybe in... Yeah, let's put it in ivory for now and then we'll see. Um, now, how are we doing this? I don't love this table, to be honest. I'm also going to get rid of that picture. Um... Tell you what I'm gonna do is grab a different table, but I'm gonna grab a, yeah, like a two by one, um, maybe the project table or, I'm not exactly sure the colors I wanna go for for this, to be honest. Um, there's a lot of the sort of like plain wooden, a uh, wooden simple, what does it, what does it call these? Yeah, wooden simple bed, for example. Um, there's a lot of those items, so they'll come in the sort of same kind of colors, basically. Um, so do we want to keep the light wood, or...? Hmm... Or... Hmm... Maybe, maybe go, maybe go white wood, and then... Hmm... This trash can actually, I think, only come, does it come in white? Oh yeah, no. Okay, I take it back. Um, but they're all in different. The, the colors are in a different order. Weirdly, that's okay though. Um, that's fine. Um, okay, let's just move this stuff like out of the way for now. And then I wanted to grab a maybe the ranch tea table, which comes in. Yeah, the white will be white with. Um, this one will come in a white. Yeah, okay. Because what I was going to do was do it, um, like this way. Um, and then put the chairs here. I don't know that I'm going to use that chair necessarily, but something like that could be good. I don't know that I like this kitchen. So I might swap it out for a different, um, a different, uh, kitchen item or combination kitchen item potentially uh depend like two items we'll see we shall see um so we could do because that's got the stove and sink and the only other one that's got a stove and sink is the kitchen island item so otherwise we need to do an individual stove and sink um what have we got in the way of sinks though um, 
Yeah, this one, which is in her base house design. So we could do that and like a stove like next to it potentially. This is more like a bathroom sink to me with like, especially with like the towels underneath it. Um, or, wait, where's the sloppy sink? I, have, I know I have that because I used it already. Oh, is that like up here with this stuff? Oh yeah. Oh right, okay. So I also have this sink, the utility sink and the sloppy sink. Um, hmm. Unless I, because the problem was if I use an item like this where it's like, I'd have to move all of this stuff back because of the size of the ranch kitchen. Um, there wouldn't be room for a stove. Um, okay, so, hmm, what if we kind of do it like this? Do we want a pink stove or? Mm, I don't know. I don't know. Listen, I, I am very, I have a very like, oops, that was an accident. I feel like I have a very bland, like, I don't, I don't like lots of colors and stuff, okay? Um. Oh, shoot. I don't like the colors that, but the, hmm. Now I don't like the colors that stuff comes in. <gasps> oh. Maybe if I, okay, maybe if I do a combination of, um, beige and white woods again. Um, like I did last time, but I'll do it differently. I'll do it different. Um, let's use the ranch tea table, maybe, because the only reason I didn't was because of the colors. Um, also, the lighting is kind of making it hard to see. <laughs> Everything just looks a bit yellow. Um, let's do that for now, and then I might soften it up, the lighting. Um, let's get rid of this, or at least move it for now. Um, yeah. And then, let's put this here, and then I'm gonna put a, actually, let's put, no, yeah, let's do that, and then I'm gonna put a plant in the corner, unsurprisingly. <laughs> um, to sort of fill out that, that space a little bit, like behind the chairs. And then, um, actually, do we want, sorry, I'm just, I just realized I don't have a fridge again. Well, hang on, let me grab a plant. Um, am I doing this plant? I always do this plant, I think. It's my favorite one. But that's okay. Um, do I want a fridge? Probably, maybe. Um, but then I would have to sort of change the layout that stuff was. Oops. Okay, well, I'm trying to rotate it this way. There we go. Um, maybe. Mm, or... What if I do it like this? So that it's like a sort of, um, like an island, essentially. Wait, what did I, what was I just gonna get? Oh, I was gonna trade that out for the bigger fridge. And then also get a, the thing with the dishes in it. That's also a ranch item. This one, the ranch cupboard. Um, Cause that's cute as well. Um, okay, let's do that, and then here. Um, I realize that there is now a, like, this gap here is weird. There is a item that's like a counter, but like it's just the one square, I think. Maybe. Or we could also use something like that, potentially, but hang on, let me have a look. Is it in by the tables? Where are the counters? Oh, they're here. Yeah. Checkout counter, I think. Because that comes in... I mean, that's gonna, like, have the appearance of, like, a checkout counter, but... Um, I don't know. We could just pretend that it doesn't. <laughs> um, I don't know. What do we think? Hmm. 
I realize that that's gonna be kind of like blocking the door like a tiny bit when you come in, just like this half of the doorway. Um, but not too bad, I don't think. I think it's okay. Um... Nope, I'm trying to turn that this way. There we go. Um, that kind of works, I think. This song's getting on my nerves a little bit, but it's fine. It's fine. Um, it's Stella's fave, so, you know, we'll make do. Um, now, what do we want out and about? I would like a snack slash food of some sort. Oh, Joseph's crying. It's getting it's getting to excursion time. Not quite, but getting there. Um, let's put out a little coffee cup. I think there's one with little like oh yeah floral. Okay, or there's just like a pink one. Let's do floral. Or mm, I feel like I haven't pulled in enough of the pink. Um, potentially, maybe. Oh, or I could do the tea cozy. Because Stella's, so Stella's a sheep. Um, and they've sort of put, like, crafted items, like, in her, um, like, in her house. Um, so I feel like the, like, mom's, like, kind of, like, knitted tea cozy could be cute. I don't like that this one has yellow accents, though. Um, I guess I could do the patterned one. That's... But the red is kind of a lot. Oh, hmm. The green one actually has a sheep on it. Um, I think it's meant to be a sheep. It looks like a sheep to me. But I don't think I want to do green. Let's do the red one, maybe. Um, yeah. Okay. Um... Now, let's grab a... Or maybe the snack bread. As if Stella's done, like, a bunch of baking, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Um, maybe some jam. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and the... I might have got... It might be the other way, actually, but the dish rack item... Oh yeah, here we go. Dish drying rack for drying your dishes. Um, cool. And then we'll put something small and decorative on top of the uh, that wardrobe. Where is the little, like maybe a little like plant potentially could be cute. Um, maybe the mini cactus set. Yeah. I think so. Do I want this mirror here or do I actually want like a comfy chair? I think I want a comfy chair. Comfy chair time. But what kind of chair? I like the patchwork chair, but I'm worried that it won't come in good colors. I feel like it comes in a sort of pink, but it's like a lot. Um. Hmm. Yeah, because my favorite one to use is this one, but I don't know. I haven't. I don't know that it's the right colors for the the. I'm gonna try and throw in some more pink, pinky accents. Uh, I'm gonna change this bed also, but um, yeah. So maybe let's. This this is a fun one. I don't know about the colors of this one either, though. Well, that actually maybe kind of works because of all the like holes in it. It's not like. Well, I don't know. I have to change the wallpaper. That's part of the problem. Is that uh, it's still the blue wall? Oops. It's still the blue wallpaper, which is kind of throwing me off a little bit. Um, I want the ranch bed. I think. Yeah. Um, in white. And then like a pink, pink gingham. Pink, pink gum? I don't think that works. <laughs> um, 
Yeah, okay, now what are we gonna do for wallpaper? I don't know. What's the one that, um, her house, it's this one. Oh, it, yeah, it's like yellow and rose, mm, okay. Eh. I do like the shape of the windows that that one comes with, though. The little, uh, like, arched ones. But alas, a quilt wall would be cute. I had this with the last one, though, where the, like, the pink is kind of a lot. I don't mind it now, I think. Because I've used less colorful furniture, I except for this chair. I will need to change that chair, I think. But I think that kind of works, the quilt wall. Let me have a look at other ones, but uh, yeah, okay, so there's like this puzzle wall. There's the other quilt walls, we know that. But I think I would like to go kind of pink for this if I can. Maybe the stripes? Eh, mm. I don't know, not my fave. Cute white wall, no, that's too, that's too much white, too boring, too boring. Um, pink painted wood wall, mm, no, not my fave. Let me go the other way. No, this is getting into like, yeah, like, uh, no, not the right vibe, okay. Um, yeah, let's maybe do the quilt wall and then I'm gonna change this chair. Or potentially just swap it out for a different chair because it doesn't... Yes, yeah, so it would probably be this one or this one. But the chair, the seat then is like red, which I don't like. And then the other one, the seat is white, but the body is like too dark a brown then, I think. Damn. All right. Different chair, different chair. I like the patchwork chair, but again, like it... Um... Doesn't, um, it doesn't come in good colors for this, I don't think. Maybe a rattan? No, that's not gonna come in good colors either. The one that's, yeah. The yellowish wicker would work, but the seed is blue, and likewise here with the white wicker. Um, yeah, okay. I don't know that it's wicker, but hopefully you know what I mean. We could do the peach chair. Or we could just put in the sort of neutralish. Mm, is that kind of a lot with that wallpaper though? Kind of feels like it is. Let me have a look. So we've got the peach chair. No, I don't like the peach chair for this. We've got this one. Um, there's not really a whole lot of like, like armchair kind of chairs, if that makes sense. Like ones that are intended for like comfort, you know? Not, 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 not intended for comfort, but, um, like lounge chairs as opposed to like dining chair chairs or like desk chairs. There, there's really only like a couple of like lounge chairs. Um, which is sad. I guess we could do like this one. Mm. No, that feels like it's like too much of all the same color now. Or it could be not an armchair at all, and it could be like a little, um, like a little stool, potentially, instead, like a cushion. Um, or I guess we could kind of get away with this, but the bottom of it's gonna be black in all of the colors, yeah. Which is gonna be too dark, likewise with this one, so. So yeah, we could maybe do like a, a footrest or a cushion kind of thing. That only comes in, yeah, those three colors. Okay. Hmm. This is what I used in the other one. I worry that's gonna be too much pink with that wallpaper though. Maybe. Oh, I guess I could do both actually, like that. That kind of works. So it's like a little sort of one person lounger or you could use it as a second chair like if you needed to. Well, let's maybe actually do it like that. Um, hang on. <laughs> I'm gonna change it back to this song. I'm just, uh, it's just bugging me right now. I'm changing it to Welcome Horizons for just a minute. <laughs> just while I finish the build and then I'll swap it back. Um, cause it was getting to me. 
Now let's actually put this like in the kitchen this time, perhaps. A kitchen mat in the kitchen? Preposterous. Um, do, 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 do. Um, do we want to do like a lacy rug? I think so. Do, do. Uh, let's maybe also do... Have we got like... Oh, we need more like cute little entrance mats. There's not enough. What do you mean there's no space? You're lying to me. Ugh, I mean, they're not, but... <laughs> yeah, it's a three by three. That's so sad. Okay, well... Where's that other cloud? Oh, it's a Mario item. It's a Mario item. Okay. Um... But what they can't take away from me is that I had an absolutely lovely day. Yes. <laughs> um... Do we want to do that? No. I'm trying to just put something, like, by the entrance, but that feels weird to me. I don't like it. I don't like it. Um, doo -doo -doo. um, now we're getting into, like, big square rugs. Mm, okay. Well, maybe we do it like that, then. I think that's fine. All right, ceiling decor. Um, hmm. What do we want to go for this time? Do, 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 do. Ooh, should we put the hanging shelves in? Oh, I worry they're not gonna... Yeah, they come in like the ironwood colors and then like... But that's gonna be too much pink because it's gonna be against the... It's gonna be against that wall. Ah, uh, maybe, maybe it's okay. I don't know. I'm trying to put it above that. There we go. Mm, maybe it's okay. Maybe it should be here above this. Mm, what do we think? Against the thing or in the middle? Actually, maybe in the middle is better. It's just kind of like floating, but... Oh, I could kind of do two. Like that. No, that's weird with the two. Is that weird just like the one floating by itself? Mm, also, if I then put a light like right in the middle of the room, is that going to be too close to it? Potentially. Is that in the middle? No. Right? Maybe? Mm. I feel as though it's not. I, no, I think it would need to come one forward to be in the middle. Oh no, I take it back. I think that is the middle. It's very hard to tell. Uh... Um, no, wait, no, that is the middle. Oops. Okay, wait, I didn't mean to move that. I meant, I, I, I'm, I accidentally moved my kitchenette. There we go. I'm trying to see where the middle of the room is. <laughs> is this lamp in the middle now? I think, I think it is. Yes, that's the middle now. Okay, right. Well, that answers my question about putting that there. Because then I can't put a light over the middle of the room. Now, I don't have... To, I could put lights not in the middle, but then I'd have to put more than one, and then I don't know what layout I would put them in. So... Maybe we do it like this? Oh, is that too much with the pink... I, I, I don't, I don't know. Oh, I'm too indecisive. There's too many decisions to make. I can't be doing all this. Um, that's fine, I think. All right, uh, let's do some wall decor. Um, start back up at the top, grab some kitchen ones. Do 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 Um I don't remember the name of the song that was originally playing, but I'm sure it'll I'm sure I'll find it. Um 
Let's just do that again, I think. Yeah. Yeah. And then let us do, hmm. Maybe, ooh. See the arms, the hands rather on this are like kind of hard to see. So let's maybe not do that one. Um, I don't want to just do the cherry blossom one again. I keep doing that. Um, maybe like a little cuckoo clock. Maybe. That's kind of cute. Um, let's grab a light switch. <laughs> We always have to put in a light switch because otherwise how are they going to turn on their lights? Um, let's put in, ooh, the little wall planter. Like above the door. Yeah. That works, I think. Do, 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 do. Um, let's do this. Do light switches actually function? No, they do not, unfortunately. You have to interact with the actual item to turn off the lights. Um, unfortunately, but that's okay. Um, you can turn off, turn on and off items, but no, yeah, it's just the, uh, it's just the interacting with the item itself. Um, it would be cool if it did. But alas. Do, do, do. Um, let's do framed poster. Sure. Um, yeah, let's do this one, actually. Um, and then let's put a... Am I just using all the same items? Yeah. Yeah, I probably am. But, like, listen, it's fine. <laughs> it is what it is. Um, oh no, I don't like that in the white. It's too hard to see. I was just trying to do something like... That would kind of stand out. Well, that also doesn't stand out. That... Oh, hi again! Bye again! <sighs> he was coming in to see if I was doing anything interesting and then decidedly not. <laughs> Which, fair enough. Valid. Uh, let's maybe do, like, a mom's art. Um, let's do this one. Do, do, do. Um, let's get an embroidery in there as well, because I think uh, Stella's a bit crafty. I actually don't know if she has the craft. I think there's a crafting, like, hobby. I don't know if she has that. But... Um, yeah, get that experience. <laughs> I don't know if she has the crafting hobby, but that's okay. She, uh, she's got a sort of like crafting theme to her. I'm also going to move this stuff around a little bit. So I'm going to put this hanging broom in. There we go. Do I want it in the white or do I want it in the natural? Have a good lurk, calmly. Um, I think in, I think in the white, actually. Yeah. Okay, hang on. I would like something on this wall. Uh, maybe another of these embroideries? Let's do the... Um, this one's very pink. It's too pink. Let's do this one. Um, I think this kind of works, maybe? Let's, I feel like this needs something above it, though. I don't know what, though. Um, maybe the, maybe the party garland? I don't think I've used the party garland yet. But that's because I don't really like the colors it comes in. <laughs> uh, it's fine. Um... Hmm. Oh, I haven't put in an AC yet. Let's put the AC in. That'll help. Okay. What do we think? I think this works. 
I think, except for this. I don't like this. It's too dark. This one's gonna be very pink, but I guess it... Well, I guess it kind of works. Mm. Okay, what if I actually put a hanging plant over there instead? What do we think? I think so. Yes. I promise they're not all gonna look like the- they're not all gonna look the same. I know that the last couple- the last two we did look very similar. <laughs> they're not all gonna look the same, I promise. <laughs> um, all done. Oh, I wanted to go add a wreath onto Ketchup's door. Um, I wanted to go add something onto the outside of Ketchup's door because I didn't do that before. And now you can- actually, can you do it a different way? I don't remember. I'm gonna- I'm gonna just try and do it now. Um... Okay. A residence home. And so then, I think, in theory, if I just select ketchup again, hopefully it doesn't undo it. That would be silly. Um, I already have your designs for both the interior, but if you like to make changes, yes. Oh, you can also cancel it. Okay. There we go. Okay. Is the bing bong bells in game? Yes, it is. That is the changing of the time. Do you want to do like a windflower wreath? Maybe? Perhaps? Or the mum wreath again? Or... Um... The lily wreath? Ooh, I don't know. I don't know. Or the mushrooms? Um... Cosmos? The Cosmos are nice, actually. Let's do the Cosmos wreath. Thought I heard the church nearby. <laughs> I was like, well, I heard it ring once. No, it was the, uh, it was the Animal Crossing thing that the hour is changing over. Um, let's do the Cosmos wreath. Yes. Uh, no, let's leave that as is. Um, yeah. Cool. There we go. Um, no! Sorry, I was trying to stop raids, but the button to do it is not in my dashboard anymore because this is a new computer. Um, there we go. Oopie. It's fine. Okay. That's pretty good progress, I would say. We've renovated three homes today. That's a lot. Normally, it takes me, like, ages to do even, like, one of them. Bell's like in Paleo. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Um... It was the hourly uh, Animal Crossing things to let you know that the hour rolled over, essentially. Um, so yeah, there we go. So we've done um, three of the houses. There are ten villagers on the island? Yeah. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, so. There we go. We have done Sherb, Ketchup, and Stella's home renovations. That's pretty good, I would say. Um... And so we're set up to be able to do um, a few uh, over the next couple streams as well. Um, along with continuing with the outside. Um, I'm not just like abandoning the outside. Um, also, I will try and I will try and um, thank you so much for the follow. Um, I'm glad you're glad you're enjoying the stream. Um, I'm not going to do them all the same. I will like switch it up a little bit. <laughs> I know that it got kind of like samey uh, the, the last two particularly. Um, so I will, I will be, like, doing them, uh, differently. It was just that, like, the two of them had, like, I, I just kind of ended up doing, like, a similar wallpaper and then, like, the, the flooring. I actually didn't change Stella's floor. I just left it as the one it was on, I think. That's okay, though. Um, but yeah, so, so next time we will probably do a couple more, um, home redecorations, or at least, like, one. Um, I might split it up next time and do like one renovation and like a little bit of outside decorating so like this bit i started decorating um in a stream um but i didn't finish it so um yeah this is probably something we'll come back to as well i did put in like a couple places where i had like a bench or a table that i was gonna put in so like that bench and this table over here as well um 
There was no table there before. The ramen was just on the floor. Uh, so I have I have put a table in. Um, but um, but yeah, so I'll probably continue with this next time and maybe do like one or two other renovations. Um, will be the plan, I think. Um, but yeah, pretty happy with our pretty happy with our progress today. <laughs>